Hi, my name is Daniel Moya. I currently go to Campo Verde High School and I'm going to be a junior this year. I have three mentors, Abilasha Viswanathan, Gabe Ogin, and um, Stephen Cohen. Our research lab focuses on how to treat level dopa induced dyskinesia using ketamine to alleviate dyskinesia. But our last main research question is how do neurodegenerative diseases such as Parkinson's affect aging, memory, and behavior in rats? Our lab wants to find an answer to this question because there is so much we don't know about neurodegenerative diseases and they want to find ways to alleviate symptoms and potentially even a cure to these diseases. Um, it is important that our lab finds an answer to this question because if we find a better treatment for a neurodegenerative disease that affects both animals and humans, then there is a possibility that this treatment could help someone who is suffering from a disease like Parkinson's. So at the moment, our lab wants to find out if injecting ketamine to Parkinsonian rats suffering from dyskinetic symptoms could counteract their jumpy and uncontrollable movement. We would help handle the rats or we would help uh, Abilasha uncoil the wire that is connected to the chip uh, that records the neurons in the rat's brain. Because when the rat was moving uncontrollably, um, he will sometimes spin around in just one direction and he will coil the wire. Our lab still has to finish the experiment but an intraperitoneal injection of Levodopa Academy for, work for one of our rats. And an intraperitoneal injection is just an injection in the belly. So we were able to see that the rat returned to slightly normal movements for 30 minutes and he became dyskinetic, then Parkinsonian again, but our lab still needs to conduct more experiments to see if there are different results. Um, some questions that I still have are, what program did they use to track the data given by the tetrodes? Why did a rat return to normal movements for a short period of time and other times the injection didn't work? How do we know the tetrodes are in the right region of the brain.